In the late 1950s, the newspaper Luxemburger Wort launched a weekly column dedicated to amateur photography from the minute. Published for about a year and a half, from late 1959 until mid-1961, the Bilder aus dem Minat, or Images from the Minat, offered a unique photographic portrait of Luxembourg's industrial region. Here, at the archives of the Luxemburger Wort, archivists assist us with the task of unearthing this largely forgotten source. As a Catholic newspaper with its headquarters in Luxembourg City, the Luxemburger Wort is perhaps not the first publication that comes to mind when one thinks of the rather left-leaning minute. Maybe it is precisely for this reason that the newspaper wanted to dedicate a special photo series to the industrial sap as a way to attract more readers there. Or maybe, with its early attempt at something that would today be called crowdsourcing, the Luxemburger Wort was trying to tap into the very lively amateur photography scene that existed and still exists today in the minute. With an amateur photo club in every industrial town, many members of the working class indeed had photography as their main hobby. With an avis aux amateurs, a call out to all photography enthusiasts, the newspaper explicitly asked readers to send in their own photos of everyday scenes in the minute. And several of those images indeed found their way into the billa. Even though it is unclear whether the Luxembourg Award received many photos that it didn't publish. After all, it is quite clear that the Billa aus dem Minat were not the equivalent of an open stage where everyone could offer whatever they wanted. In fact, the column gives the impression of having been tightly curated. With dozens of photos, the Luxembourg Award did not merely portray the Minat. Both the selection of images and the addition of captions created a framing of the region that matched the newspaper's ideological position. Catholic, politically conservative, and concerned with social peace and traditional values such as religion. Let us explore this framing in some more detail. One of the central ideas conveyed by the Billa was the belief that the Minnet was characterized by a strong sense of harmony. By juxtaposing images of leisure with those of industry, the reader was given the impression that there was a perfect balance between the two. The duty of labor came first, of course, but afterwards workers could enjoy a healthy pastime on the football pitch or in nature. The Minet was indeed portrayed as a rather unique industrial region because of the physical proximity between industry and nature. Not far from the massive iron and steelworks in places like Esch, Defedange and Dudelange, one could find parks and vast woodland areas, where workers and their families could temporarily escape the noise and dusty air of the factory towns and iron mines. As such, the Luxembourg Avot did not see a contrast between nature and industry. Both spheres were seen as complementary as is perfectly illustrated in this photo of a couple enjoying the view of the Chifflange plant while sitting on a bench in the Gallier Birch Park in Esch. Another photo offers the same panorama. The combination of green spaces and industry is described in the caption as nothing less than romantic. Yet, on rare occasions, the Billa did leave some room for criticism, as for instance in this photo of the heavily polluted Alzat River near the Schifflange steelworks, which was accompanied by the caption, a dead river. When will it come back to life? It was the only photo of this kind, however, and no images were devoted to the other environmental plague that overshadowed life in the minute. Air pollution. Another aspect of the harmony ideal that was emphasized in the Billa aus dem Minat can be found in the depiction of religion. Everyone knew that the Minat was rather left-leaning and that religious life there was often characterized by a so-called four wheels Catholicism, meaning that people only attended church when they were driven there for important occasions, such as baptisms, weddings and funerals. Yet, the Luxemburger Wort insisted on the idea that religion was not and should not be an alien phenomenon in an industrial region. It conveyed this idea mainly by focusing on the infrastructure of religion. In other words, by showing pictures of churches. 
On one occasion, the Billa showed a visit by the Bishop of Luxembourg to the village of Kehl, where he was greeted by local dignitaries for the annual First Communion festivities. In this way, the newspaper wanted to highlight the interwovenness of the political and religious realms. All in all, the Bilaus de Minet encapsulated the industrial south in a period when post-war reconstruction had come to an end, but the massive economic growth, optimistic consumerism and libertarian tendencies of the golden 60s were yet to make their appearance. The Bilaus de Minet depicted a thirst for harmony, but also a time of rapid transitions, with a population torn between a longing for traditional social values and an irresistible desire for modernity and progress. The certainties of an old world seemed to be under threat, while the contours of a new world were becoming increasingly visible. For photographers, there was indeed much to document. We warmly invite you to browse through the entire collection of Billa photos and read more about them in the essay below.